Today we're going over the different models of the Prony knee pad. Over the years we've had quite a few, and if you're ordering replacement parts, then you're going to need to know what model you have. So let's get started. We'll start with our original model. We sold these from 1989 to 2007. This particular version has a brown liner, don't get caught up on that. We had different colors of liners. Telltale sign that it's a original model is the snaps that hold the liner to the frame and the rubber boot to the frame. If your knee pad has snaps, it is definitely an original model. In 2007, we came out with the model 07 and sold it until 2014. The main difference between the model 07 and the original model is the boots on the model 07 have screws holding them to the frame instead of the snaps that you found on the original model. Also, the model 07 has the liner that wraps around to the front side and the foam has the wings on it. Also, we were experimenting with different styles of boots, so your model of 07 may have had something that looked like that on it. So this being the model 07 and this being the original model, you can see the differences between the screws holding the boots on and the snaps. There are no wings on the foam of the original, but there are on the model 07. In 2014, we came up with the model 0714 standard and the model 0714E wide. So when you're determining what model, if you have the standard 0714 or the wide model 0714E, take a measurement from the inside of the foam. The standard measures five and a quarter inches straight across and the wide measures seven and three sixteenths of an inch from foam tip to foam tip. Determine if you have the model 0714 or one of our previous models. The model 0714 has a new frame with ribs on it that the previous models did not have. No ribs, ribs. Also, the previous models had rivets holding the buckles to the frame where the current model 0714 has screws. Lastly, the model 0714 has a cuff buckle mount, a hard plastic outer that the model 07 does not have on the outside of the ankle foam wings. Over the years with the model 0714, we've made a few upgrades, haven't changed the model, but we've added the new Smart Lock Plus buckles and we have tucked in the liners. You'll see when the 0714 first came out, the liners were held with a hook and loop on the sides, and these were our standard buckles. In 2020, we made some upgrades to the model AP16, and those were the addition of our Smart Lock Plus buckle, which allowed for a wider strap on the AP16 compared to the old version. And we started tucking in our liners to keep them more secure than the older version. We did have to make a change to the frame to accommodate for the wider strap, as shown here between the two. Now that we've determined what model of Prony knee pad you have, you might need to determine what size you have if you're ordering something like a rebuild kit or replacement foam. If you determined you have an original model or a model 07, you might have the size engraved on the shin plate of the knee pad. If your knee pads don't have the size engraved on it, one simple measurement and a reference to our chart will tell you. So you measure from below the boot to the high point of the arc of the frame. In this case, I've got seven and a half. Reference this chart and you'll see that that's a size 22, which it is. One more example on this original model, take the same measurement from below the boot to the high point of the arc, five and a half inches, it means this is a size 20, and it is. Reference the chart. If you have our model 0714 or 0714E wide, you may have a sticker on the side of the knee pad that tells you what size it is. If you don't have the sticker, the way to find your size is to pull up the foam on the shin area of the knee pad. You'll see a list of sizes in there. The size across from the letters AB on the outside of the frame is your size. In this case, size 21, across from the AB, this is a size 21. Thanks for watching.